What's going on, everybody? Today we're doing the last round, round four, of Little T's Baseball Card Repack. That's all I have for now. I got uh, more stuff coming in. I had enough to do a bunch more as far as like graded cards go, but um, I did not have enough relics to uh, do any more packs, but they're coming in. So if anybody's ever interested, just let me know. Big D's, what's going on? Is Sports, Jay Greenberg, Jacob, Bradley Card Store, what's up everybody? Um, I think you guys know by now how these work. If not, I'll give you a quick rundown. Get these out of the way. Move these in the frame. So what we do is, uh, it's drafted hit style. Um, I open up all 10 of the packs, all the sealed packs. Um, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Open up all the sealed packs. At the end, we go on random.org here, randomize the draft list. And then you guys pick the entirety of the packs in the order in which you guys want. So, um, you know, you can't, like, pick and choose individual parts from each pack. So, you know, if you want this relic, if you're the number one pick, you can't be like, oh, I want that relic, and I want that pack, and I want... Uh, and I want uh, that graded card. It's kind of all, all in one kind of deal. Which makes sense. Edgar, what's up? Andrew, what's going on? And again, um, I posted it yesterday. I am we doing a podcast with uh, one of my buddies on here, uh, Natsman72. Check him out. Uh, check out his YouTube. He, uh, him and I share a lot of uh, same opinions and views about the hobby. And, you know, like, we were both in it before it, you know, it exploded, as I'm sure most of you were. And... Uh, yeah, David, I got one spot left because somebody didn't uh, didn't send payment. So if you want, I was gonna run it with nine. I was gonna open them all up. I was luckily Edgar came in and because it would have been eight now, but uh, he grabbed that last spot and then somebody else dropped out. So if you want in on this, just let me know. Um, or else we're gonna run it with nine. Uh, Mike, what's going on? You working tonight? Uh, these are thirty five per pack. Uh, comes with a graded card. And then after, um, after uh, the last round, I'm gonna put together another another couple. All right, David, cool. Got you down, man. Thanks for that. Put you down just in the spot. Uh, the person who didn't get back to me, which is fine. Not a big deal. Um, but yeah, we share a lot of the same views on the hobby, so definitely check that out. I think it's gonna be good. Um, and. Uh, Probably be on there for a while. So, uh, without further ado, we're going to see what we got in these packs. Uh, first three rounds, I think, were a pretty big success. So, hopefully, it's more of the same here. Everybody kind of gets what they want. All right, Caleb. Yeah, definitely, man. I'm definitely going to be running more. And uh, when I do, I'll shoot I'll shoot you a message and, uh, you know, we can, can kind of get together on, on that. So, the first pack... You hear my dog wheezing. <laughs> Is a uh, he's gonna have a jersey relic of Clayton Kershaw, one fifty four three ninety five. This is from the brand new twenty twenty tops tier one, and you can't really hide. You know, either way, you can you. I mean, you guys know what's uh what's going on. After that, we got twenty twenty tops of the brand new twenty twenty tops mint nine Nico Horner rookie card, blue jersey. This card looks really good too. I'm not an expert on grading, but I think it's just surface issues on the back that kind of did it in. Um, little, like, white spots on the back. But otherwise, the front of the card looks looks really, really good. Wait, please, don't miss this hilarious comment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. Hand me, here, hand me that. This. I want to submit this back. Do you think they'll take it? I want to submit <laughs> it and just get it slabbed, like, as a joke. 
I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Probably resend it back to me. And then a pack of 2020 Top Series 1. So that's pack number one. Again, you get all, you pick the entirety of the pack. So that's pack number one. Pack number two. Yeah, that's your girl, little T. Hey. Pack number two. Uh, Mike. We're going to start off with the 2018 Tops Gallery. After that, 2018 Tops Chrome Mint 9 Miguel Andujar rookie card. I'm a big fan of his. I think he's going to have, you know, I thought he was going to have a really big year. Yeah, my dog ate that, Manningly. Thought he was going to have a huge year this year. Uh, with a shortened season, we'll see. I thought he was going to put up big numbers like he did in his rookie campaign. But nonetheless, the flagship uh, Chrome rookie It's always a good one to have. I think he's going to be a great, guy. great, great player. And then Christian Yelich, Jersey Relic, numbered 64 of 199. And that's from 2020 Top Series 2. So the brand new 2020 Top Series 2. Yeah, man, I think Andujar is super underrated. Super, super underrated. So that's pack number two. Sure, I keep these straight. And a nice relic of uh, one of the best players on the game right now. That's pack number two. Pack number three. I I should rename the pup Mattingly. I want to get her like a Donnie baseball jersey or something. Just like as a joke. After that, we got the impossible to find 2020 Bowman. With a 2018 Topps Living Set PSA 9 of Glaber Torres. I love the look of these cards. They're kind of like sketchy. Um, I just think they're really nice. Again, I'm not a grading expert, but I just think, like, right here, you can probably see, like, the little white on that corner did it in. And I love the back, too, with the, uh, like, the facsimile autograph. Love the old school back. And that will also come with 2001 Upper Deck Dual Bats of Rafael Palmero and Jim Tomey. So at the time... You know, that, those two, Frank Thomas, some of the first, best first basemen in the game back in uh, 2001 for sure. So that's pack number three. Pack number four. He's going to start off with yeah, see, I can't really cover it. I guess if I did that. 2019 Top Series 2, the highly coveted, highly, uh, you know, shooting up in price Top Series 2. With all the big rookies in there. After that, Mark McGuire, 1987, Top Rookie Card, PSA 6, in the old slab. His stuff shot up a ton. Yeah, the iconic 1987 tops. Uh, big hits, of Miami. For the uh, the uh, Edgar, you got like spot ten and nine eight, and seven, but we still got to do the random, and then it's a draft. So uh, those are just your random spots. And then a jersey relic from 2001 upper deck of Sammy Sosa. I thought it was cool to put these guys kind of together. If you're, you know, a fan of baseball during that time, these two, you know, were the biggest story in all sports. Um, so that's pack number four. That's a pretty good one. Like that one for sure. Pack number five. See if I can't. Yeah, there we go. I don't have to spoil it. We're going to start off with 2019 Bowman, which is impossible to find now. Uh, everybody wants that wander. It was kind of late to the party. Yo, Vinny, what's up, man? What's going on? So pack number five is going to start off with 2019 Bowman. After that, a cool card. I saw it. I had to pick it up. This is Michael Jordan from 1995 Upper Deck Prospect Card. PSA 7 near Mint. That's a really, that's just a cool card, man. 
I, uh, once the last dance came out, you know, I, his stuff started just shooting up in all sports, you know, and his basketball stuff obviously shot up like double, you know, for his PSA 10 rookie, but his baseball stuff kind of, kind of shot up too. So I thought this was a cool pickup kind of for the PC. Um, that's a cool card. And after that, Alex Rodriguez, Rafael for call, dual bat relic from 2001 upper deck. So it's pack number five. Right there. With a shot at the Wander. And also uh, Julio Rodriguez and Luciano. All right, pack number six. And as soon as I, uh, I can, I'm going to put more of these together. I, um, and I'm going to definitely incorporate them in my future breaks. So if I do like a, you know, a box break of, of museum or, you know, whatever, I'll, uh, I'll throw in a couple of these too, just to kind of spice it up. Uh, pack number six is going to start off with 2019 Topps Heritage High Number. So look for all the big rookies there. After that, sorry, I know, I knew this was like going to piss somebody off and like, like fool them because I saw the Acuna. I mean, but it's the tops now Acuna, which came before the update. So this is like the original, the original picture, um, and I thought it was kind of cool because everybody has the update version, right? So um, you know you get to actually see exactly the moment that that picture came from. And I thought that was kind of cool. Um, so this is week four. Moment of the week, top rookie phenom called up, adds additional spark to young lineup. And on the back, you know, it's got like that tops kind of hologram seal. Um, not a cheap card either by any means or anything, but just compared to it, you know, his flagship rookie, obviously. But that's from April 23rd to April 29th, 2018. That was the moment of the week. So I thought that was really cool. I wanted to get this card in there. Sorry there. Set of pause due to connection. Um, after that, another really cool card. Greg Maddox and Randy Johnson. A couple of pitchers. Best pitchers of all time. Their game used bats. From 2001 Upper Deck. So this is a really good pack. Uh, you got the Acuna. This relic is really cool. I should have picked one up for my, uh, for my own PC. That's pack number six. Yeah, I like that hologram a lot. I don't own um, any other tops now, like they're like you know moment of the week cards or anything like that. So I am curious to see if I'm sure they're on all of them. It's just kind of cool. I wonder why they don't do that. Yeah, I love that commercial. Uh, pack number seven is going to start off with 2020 tops heritage. After that, 1985 tops Pete Rose PSA seven. I love this card, too, because uh, I don't know if you can see that. His, his position is first base manager, um, which is pretty cool. Not a lot of, you know, you don't see a lot of cards that has a, a position like that. And then Roberto Alomar, Hall of Famer Roberto Alomar, Jersey Relic from 2001 Upper Deck. That's pack number seven. The 80, iconic 85 set, which is now getting showcased in all the 35th anniversary stuff, which which is really cool because one of my favorite one of my favorite designs. Uh, Kasich last time got the uh, the Clemens rookie, which was from 85 Upper Deck. Nope, I haven't randomized the uh, the order yet. So just keep in mind what you'd uh, what you're kind of thinking if you get that number one spot as we go along here. He absolutely should be in the Hall of Fame. Absolutely should be in the Hall of Fame. It's more hits than anybody who's ever played the game. So, Pack number eight. That's a good one. I'm going to start off with the... It's kind of, kind of like bending there. Uh, 2018 Tops Update. Another product that has absolutely just shot. Shot up in price. Very hard to find. Even though I see people like picking it up on clearance at Walmart, which is just wild to me. Uh, not only they, can they find it, it's also like marked down. 2018 tops. After that, another set I am a big fan of. 1986 tops 
Ryan Sandberg in the brand new PSA slab. Near Mint 7. I like that card a lot. I want to throw some, some 80s old school in there. Show off some sets that I don't think get talked about enough. I'm excited for 2021 because the 35th anniversary will be uh, the 86 design, which is another really nice design. And then Eddie Murray, Heroes of the Hall from 2001 Upper Deck, Game Use Bat Relic. So we've got some old school stuff in there too. So that's a good, uh, that's a good one for a variety of reasons. If you ever want to hunt for an Acuna or a Soda or a Glaber or an Otani. Or if you like that Sandberg. Pack number nine. We have the brand new 2020 Top Series 2. After that, 2018 Bowman Shohei Otani, PSA 9. This stuff is just crazy now. He's really shooting up. It's a really nice card. All right, no problem, man. I'll pick for you. All right, no, you're not in on this one, are you? Thanks for stopping by, Mike. I appreciate it. Stay safe, brother. After that, Patrick Corbin. That's a what's a quad color jersey patch. So four color jersey patch. From 2019 Hits Memorabilia, which is one of my Hidden Gems favorite products. They just have like crazy, crazy stuff in there. Um, and they have a database where you can see everything that was authentic. Auth 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 I don't even, I'm not going to even try. Yeah, hopefully uh, whoever uh, gets this hit up uh, AK. For sure. My baseball collection. So that's pack number nine. That Bowman. Top Series 2. And the last pack. If we can get something good here. Can't even remember what I put in these. It was so long ago. Another 2018 Tops Gallery. Which these do guarantee like one autograph per box. So it's pretty good. 2019 Topps Chrome, Topps Chrome, Bowman Chrome, it's actually Bowman Draft, JJ Bladé, Chrome Batting PSA 9, he was the, uh, the fourth overall pick in last year's draft, in the 2019 draft, it's a really nice card, I want to get that in there, I got a bunch of uh, first Bowmans of I got one. I have a refractor of Riley Green, which now I don't even know if I should put in here because it probably shot up in price after that insane catch that he made. Um, but I have a refractor of his. I was gonna put in here, but uh, it didn't get here in time. And then after that, another uh, Miami guy, Alex Rodriguez, then and now dual jersey relic on the Mariners and on the Rangers. So this is the last pack. Kind of went out with a bang there, with that. Gallery's a really good pack, especially with all those rookies. The JJ Bladé, PSA 9 Mint, first Bowman Chrome, and the A-Rod. So I'm going to go over to random.org. We're going to do the draft order. And then I'll show the cards again if anybody needs me to. Let's run through them again. And um, we will... I don't want to restart. Remind me tomorrow. We'll pick... Pick your packs. All right, so we're going to see how many times we're going to randomize this list. What would I say is the best one? See, that's it's a, it's tough, Jared. Um, we're going to go seven times. Uh, I'll do this, and then I'll uh, gather my thoughts. One. Of course, this always happens to me. That's just one. This is two. Three. Four, five, six, 
And last time, good luck, seven. So we got William, Triple Crown, Big D's, Big Hits Miami. Jared, William again. Mason is sports, Big Hits Miami. And then Ryan. That is your draft order. Um, let you guys marinate that a little bit. I'm going to send this out. I think William's in here, but I'm just going to send it out. So that everybody... I know sometimes... I sent everybody messages uh, beforehand. Let them know he's going live, but... If not, just have to pick for him. Um, but it's tough to determine, like, kind of, like, what packs are the best because, uh, you know, like... There's, a, there's sealed packs in it, right? So, like, right now, you could be like, oh, well, I think this that pack is the best because of the graded card or, or the relic or, you know, a mix of both. But, you know, then if you have the 2018 update pack and you pull, I mean, who knows, you could pull, like, an Acuna or a Soto or something, like, something crazy, then, well, then, you know, that now becomes the best pack. So, um, you know, it's kind of kind of interesting, um, fun, fun little niche. Um, I'll go over all the packs now, though. Uh, that is your order. William, Trip. Dante, you got that second spot. David, in that three spot. I'll go over the packs now. What was in them? But William is up first. I sent him a message. I sent him the live, so. Let's see if he can't get in here. Uh, pack number nine was the Trout... Hey, Ryan, what's up, man? You got the uh, you got the last spot, but um, as we know, something crazy can always fall to you. Uh, 2020 Top Series 2, Corbin and Shohei. That is a one set. Another set was 2018 Update, Eddie Murray and Sandberg. It's another set. And again... I'll, I'll keep showing, um, you know, how many, however many times you need. I don't, I don't mind. Uh, pack number four was Sammy Sosa. Top Series 2 from 2019. So look for the Vlad, the Tatis, and then the Mark McGuire. So, Dante, that's what the, uh, that's what the McGuire pack had. Sammy Sosa, away jersey relic, 2019 Top Series 2 and McGuire. Rookie PSA 6. Pack number 3 had the Glaber Living Set. This was uh, number 3. It's a graded a 6 in the, uh, in the old slab. This is... Um, 2020 Bowman. And then Rafael Palmero and Jim Tomey Dual Bat Relics. That's, that was pack number 3. Yeah, it's not like the most insane grade on the um, on the McGuire. I th think what did it in was it's off centered, left to right, or right to left, excuse me, or left to right, whatever way you think about it. But it looks clean on the front. That's why I picked this particular one up. This was uh, when I was had intentions of picking up for the PC. Um, but then when I decided I wanted to do this, I threw it in here. Yeah, the Glaber's nice. And that's the thing, like, you know, you can hit a Dominguez auto, in theory, right? So, um, pack number two was Christian Yelich, Jersey Relic. PSA 9, Mint, Miguel Andujar from 2018 Tops Chrome. And 2018 Tops Gallery. That was pack number two. The last pack that we had was that Blood Day. PSA 9, first Bowman Chrome. Another pack of 2018 Gallery. And then A-Rod, then and now dual Jersey Relics. And I'm always looking for feedback um, on what you think I could do better. Like, as far as the product goes, um, I think it's cool to have the Relics in there. Because that can kind of... I add, like, autographs and stuff in them, too. Uh, pack number seven was... 
85 Tops Pete Rose, first base manager, PSA 7. A pack of 2020 Heritage, and then a Roberto Alomar jersey relic. Um, but if you guys are like, oh, you know, just add more value to, you know, the graded card, you know, we can always do stuff like that. I'm always open for suggestions, so. Uh, pack number six was that Acuna Tops Now, PSA 9 Mint, the dual, jer dual bat relics of Maddox and Johnson, and then 2019 Tops Heritage High Number. So definitely let me know. Always open. Always open for suggestions. Pack number five was that really cool Michael Jordan. Alex Rodriguez. And Rafael for call dual bat relic from 2001 Upper Deck. And then 2019 Bowman with a shot at that uh, with Wander. And the first pack that we had was Nico Horner, 2020, Top Series 1, PSA 9. It's like, must have just came back from grading. Uh, 2020, Tops Tier 1, Clayton Kershaw, Jersey Relic, number 395. And then lastly, 2020, Top Series 1 pack. So those are your packs. Uh, William's on the clock. I sent him a message. Uh, if he's not here, I will pick for him. Uh, and the tough thing about this is they're all kind of like the same value, like price-wise. So it's really just like kind of crapshoot, like with what you get in the packs. If that's, but like value-wise, they're all pretty much the same. Um, after that is triple crown trading. Then David uh, and Edgar. Then you got Jared, William again, Mason, Is Sports. Then you got Big Hits Miami again, and then Ryan. I'm going to resend that thing to William one more time. Just to uh, give him a shot. In the meantime, if there's any packs that uh, you want to see closer up of the card, maybe you're like thinking you might want to resubmit something. You know, to SGC or BGS. Or again, to, you know, to PSA for like that, that McGuire. So. Slammed. Just let me know. Yep, no problem. The pack with the Jordan was, and it is in the new PSA slab, it's 1995 Upper Deck Minor League, MJ hitting, and it was the uh, the one-on-one -on -one set, PSA 7. It's just a very, like, nostalgic card. Definitely, as David said. It's a very, very cool card. It also had the uh, 2019 Bowman with Wander and uh, Julio Rodriguez possibilities, and then an A-Rod and Raphael for call dual bat relic. So that was uh, that pack. Um, doesn't look like Williams in here. Um, so I'm going to have to pick for him. I'm going to pick based on value, and just I guess I have to combine, you know, I just combined all the prices of everything. And that would be the Shohei. Otani PSA 9 from Bowman would take the cake on that one. So let me grab that for him. And then I'm actually... Uh, so this is uh, what William's going to be going home with with that number one spot just based on pure value. Congrats on that. We'll open up the pack for him now. See what you guys get. See if you guys made the right decision. You know, if like there's a no name Robert in here or something. You know, obviously this would have been the number one. 
uh, Ramos, Arias, Piscotti, Hunter Harvey, Austin Hayes, <laughs> Ian Happ, Maggie, Chris Bryant, Freddie Freeman. Heard he's not playing this year. It's kind of unfortunate. I love watching him play. After that, Joe Maurer, Turkey Red, Frank Thomas, Nunez, and Ivan Nova. So no, no Roberts in there, unfortunately. And then Tripp, you said, just got to make sure you said you wanted the Maguire with the Tati Series 2 rookie. Yeah, if it's in there, that would be pretty cool. Um, for those of you who were in the first one, um, we're also in this one. All your stuff's going to be getting shipped out together. I uh, wanted to ship it out the night of, but I have uh, new bubble mailers coming in. I thought they were going to come in last week, um, but they're on track to come in tomorrow. Um, they're bigger. I wanted to make sure everything was like very well protected. The bubble mailers that I have now would have been fine, but I just, you know, I just thought they were better. So I'm just going to wait the extra day. And I'm sure you all would rather that than me. You know, safety of the cards. I put over getting it a day earlier. Um, where's that? Where's that rookie? Grabbing that for you, Dante. Here we go. Yeah, I'll rip it for you. Um, so Dante with the number two picks going with the Maguire rookie, Sammy Sosa relic. Uh, she's kind of holding down the dog right now. <laughs> Let's see. I think I got the hot hand for you. Good vibes only, right? Uh, Herrera rookie. Slater. Ramirez rookie. You got... Uh, that would have been a nice card if it was a Tatis. The 150 years stamped Bobby Pointer rookie. <laughs> so you were looking for, right? Uh, Mookie on the Red Sox. Luis Ortiz. Brian Goodwin. Bregman. Baez. David Fries. Davinsky and Norris. So now the big rookie's there. Unfortunately, on that one, nonetheless, going home with the McGuire PSA rookie is not never a bad thing. Um, let's see what we got up now. Up next, we got David, and then it's going to be Edgar, and then Jared. You want you want me to send that Bobby Pointer to David? <laughs> no problem. I mean, isn't he the rookie? The that's the flagship rookie everybody's looking for, right? That looked like it, you know, it was good centering. Could have been Gem Mint. Uh, David, you're up now. Uh, if you need me to go any, over any of them, just let me know. Yeah, man, the, uh, the, the ones I have now are are in really good shape. I sent a couple to PSA, but the other ones I had were just so crappy. I just wanted to get one in a slab, so that's why I got it. And then I saw one, and I was like, I picked it up raw, and I sent it in. And I was like, well, I'll put that one in the in the repack now. So, um, David, what pack comes with the Acuna? With the Acuna pack, like the update. So the bat down, or not the bat down? Huh, jokes. Uh, the tops now. Acuna moment of the week comes with uh, the Maddox and Randy Johnson dual bat relic and then 2019 high number. So, you know, you got the Vlad and the Tatis in there. Um, but if you're referring to the 2018 update with a shot at the, you know, the update Acuna that came with Eddie Murray and Ryan Sandberg. Um, that Andujar is also, yeah, like everybody's saying, is a really nice option. Um... The Glaber living set comes with uh, 
Palmero and Tomy Bat Relic, and then a pack of 2020 Bowman. Uh, the one that everybody's talking about right now. The Yelich comes with a Jersey Relic with a pinstripe number to 199. Miggy. And then Topps Gallery. Um, yeah, pretty much. You got, you know, the Bullet A. The MJ, which is definitely like a PC pick. Um, just let me know what you want. You want to do the Acuna? The uh, the Top Snow one, I'm assuming. Which comes with, in my opinion, my favorite relic in, in you know, this round. And then the Heritage High number. Just making sure before I rip it. All right, cool. Yeah, this is an awesome card. Um, you know, it'll never obviously catch up with, like, you know, the update uh, card or anything like that. But, um, you know, to have the same exact picture I thought was really cool. Kind of like an origin story. You can kind of put them side by side, something like that, and be like, well, you know, this is the moment that it came from. So uh, this is 2019 Top Saturday Chai number. So Gonzalez, Maldonado, Bryce Harper, G-Man Choi. Vogelbach, McMahon, Alex Jackson, rookie, Brad Anderson, and Eduardo Escobar. So the packs so far in like all rounds have been like kind of lackluster. I'm kind of disappointed. Thought that would kind of be the actually Mason Klee chasing hit a a short print Acuna insert, which is pretty pretty sweet. So. Yeah, the first pack I'll show, uh, it was the, uh, had the Nico Horner in it, PSA 9 rookie. I believe that was the first pack. Usually that and the Miggy. Um, that Acuna is really nice. I would, you know, I really like, I like the hologram on the back too. I know that kind of sounds like kind of corny, but. Um, pack with the Nico was pack number one. Uh, series one, Kershaw. Tier 1 Relic, and then the PSA 9 Nico. Uh, big Hits Miami's on the clock, I'm pretty sure. I know who, where you're going to go. Yep, you're, uh, you're up. I'm pretty sure. You had your eye on one. Just let me know. We can... Uh, can get that for you. Okay, cool. Yeah, JBs, man, I, I like doing this. It's a lot of fun. Um, kind of got the idea from just like being in a lot of breaks, and then I'm also a breaker, so like doing a lot of breaks for people, and people just get like absolutely skunked, like which stinks. I mean, obviously, we know what we're getting ourselves into. When you join a break, obviously there's no guarantee of anything, but you know, like Dante, like my buddy Triple, joined in a, a full case of tier one with the Dodgers, which is like, you know, a sure fire, gonna get at least something, and he went absolutely hitless. And the crazy part was the Yankees in that break went hitless too, and after that I was like, man, that is just messed up. I gotta, I got so I started thinking, kind of did like I do autograph free packs, and uh, do these ones. So this is what Edgar's going home with. Big Hits Miami. This is a really nice card. 2019, first Bowman Chrome from Bowman Draft. Blade. PSA 9 Mint. Alex Rodriguez. Then and now dual Jersey Relic. So I have this in my PC. Uh, same exact card. And let's see what we can get you out of this. All right. Miguel Gomez. Rookie. Clint Frazier, rookie. Ooh, Aaron Judge. It's a pretty nice looking card. Abreu. And Christian Arroyo, rookie. And then featured artists. Which is just like a 
kind of like a little filler that they put in probably people weigh in packs and stuff like that. I hate that. Not a bad pack. That judge is really cool. Yeah, I know. The rip pack, I'm like, I'm excited to see like the, the 18 update and the Bowman. I w really want to pull an autograph. Even if it's just like an okay one. I just want to be like, yeah, we pulled an autograph out of a, out of the little T repacks. Out of a seal pack. Uh, away. Jared, you are up. Um, if you want me to go over anything, give opinions on anything, just let me know. You ask the chat for their opinions. Um, but like I was saying before, there's really no like surefire, surefire choice. Um, you know, the Anduhar is a very, very good card. With the you know, autograph possibility with the update, the Yelich Relic. That's a very solid, well-balanced pack. If you're into more vintage stuff, you know, you got Sandberg, Murray, and then a shot at the Acuna and Soda. Thanks, David. I appreciate it, man. Yeah, like, I want, you know, there's nothing against Topps products, but sometimes you just, it, you know, I say this all the time. They're very feast or famine. And when you're hot, you're hot. You know what I mean? Like, when you're hot, you're hot. But lately, I just wasn't having the hot hand as a breaker. And I just, like... Not that I felt like I was losing customers, because I think they realize... You know, I think everybody here realizes it has nothing to do with the person opening the opening the box, you know? It has everything to do with just the luck. But sometimes you can't help it. Like, you know, I break with you, and I get nothing. I break with him, and I get stuff. I'm going to go to him. Uh, this is a pack with the Nico. Um, let me get it a little bit more centered. Uh, 2020 Top Series 1, Clayton Kershaw Relic, and then Nico PSA 9. And again, the front of it is near perfect. Um, I think, really think what did it in from getting that 10 grade, which you guys can probably see, there's like, there's white marks on the back, with just like minor surface issues. I don't think that's anything you can clean up if you were going to like resubmit. Um you know, it could have been the last pack, and the last card in the pack or something like that and just got scuffed up. But unfortunately, I think that's the only thing that's holding it back. Corners look really good. The edges look good. I'm not a, you know, an expert on grading by any means. But that was one thing I was like, oh, I think that's what, what did it in. This is the Miggy. Uh, PSA 9 Mint. I don't know if you guys can see. Those aren't on... The slab, those are print lines. So that's definitely what did that in. Still got a nine, which just shows you how strong the rest of the card is. Um, that came with Yelich. And Topps uh, Gallery from 2018. The Glaber pack is another well-rounded one. 2019 uh, rookie Glaber from Living Set. Love that. I want to pick up all the... Uh, all the rookies from 18 and 19 and living set. I think they look really good with Rafael Palmeira and Jim Tomey. And then, you know, you shot at a Dominguez or a Witt. Um, Pete Rose, too. Player manager. Heritage from 2020 and Hall of Famer Roberto Alomar. And then you got the, uh, the nostalgic, the Jordan. The A-Rod for call. And then 2019 Bowman. So you got a shot at the, uh, the Wander, which is skyrocketing in price, as everything else is, though. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, like this is, a, this is fun for me. I know everybody's going to go home with something good, you know. Uh, you're going to go with the Glaber. Sweet. And good luck on this Bowman pack, too. Uh, 2018 Glaber, PSA 9. Glaber's my guy, so uh, I got to pick one of those up for myself. Uh, Paul Merrill and Tommy. And let's see what you can get you out of the Bowman pack. Good luck. Travis Demerit. John Means. Vogelbach. Spanning the Globe. Chromincer of Jordan Belazovic. Gus Varland for his Bowman paper. Nate Pearson. We got a blue paper of Nick Madrigal. Not bad. Blue paper numbers 67 and 150. 
Not bad at all. Thought it was a uh, thought it was a Robert. Drew Mendoza and Wilfred Estudio for Bowman Chrome. So Williams Estudio's uh, brother there. Seth Brown rookie, Bieber, and Bellinger. Not a bad pack of Bowman. Obviously, everybody's kind of hunting the Dominguez, so unfortunately we didn't get get him. But overall, not a bad pack. Get some color in there. And the first Bowman Chrome is always good. You never know. Congrats on that. Jared, uh, Williams up again, so I got a pick for him. Then Mason, who I'm not sure. Yeah, it was a good pack. I would, you know, if you ripped that retail, you'd be happy with it. It's above average for sure. Um, let me just send this out really quick. Again, just make sure. If not, I gotta, I'm got. i going to have to pick for him. Perfect. So give that a second. Um, but yeah, like I, I hate when people go hitless. I hate when I go hitless. But uh, if anybody's interested too, I did some personals last night of the Big C autograph repacks. Um, we got a, a Wander Auto in there and a Johnny Bench Bronze Inc. from Tier 1. Uh, just did some personal. So if anybody ever wants a little T-Pack personal or a Big C, I can send it sealed. It doesn't matter to me. I can rip before you live. Whatever you guys want, I'm cool with. Just uh, If you're ever interested, interested, just let me know. I got to pick for him, though. It's not value. Yeah, it's like a tie. Yeah, so William's not in here, so I'm going to have to pick for him. And the pick would be the Miggy, which is an amazing card. Felt the number six overall. Um, like well, all these, I, I thought anything could go number one. That's why I, I kind of like set them up. I just want to make sure that they're all evenly, you know, kind of distributed. So this is going to be going to William. It comes with that Christian Yelich jersey relic to 199 from Series 2. And then let's see what we can get out of his pack. Hits Products, what's up, man? Shout out to uh, to Hits Products on uh, this awesome breakers mat that he gifted me with. Very, very nice guy. Uh, Chris Bryant. Tim LaCastro, rookie. Oh, we got an auto. I'll save that. Ooh, I'm excited. It's a rookie, too. Oh, boy. This could be a big pack. Puig and Nolan Ryan. But yeah, definitely check out uh, Hits Products. He has awesome breakers mats. Um, they're really, really, <laughs> they're really nice. I like uh, ripping like just personally on them because he has, you know, put your packs here. It keeps me organized. Otherwise, I'm not very organized when I rip. I just kind of throw, you know, rookies in a pile. And but all right, let's see what it's a Padre. Uh, it's 2018 though. Is that Fran Meal? Fran Meal Reyes. Rookie Auto. Green. Number to 99. There we go. We finally uh finally got a good one there. Finally. So that's a good one. It's kind of like the what well, I'm looking. Obviously, Fran Meal Reyes is an okay name, not nothing crazy. There is white on that corner. Not bad. Not a bad little extra to get out of a out of a pack, you know, so. Frame Mill Reyes. So that is all going to William. And I got to pick for Mason now. And that's going to be the, uh, the corner based on value. And then after that is sports. Uh, big hits, you got your other spot. And then... See what Ryan gets. Always, always very curious to see what the last pack is going to be. Uh, so Mason's going to be going home with the Kershaw relic, the Horner rookie. Let's see if we can get anything good out of uh, his pack of series 
Series 1. And then Isra up next. Got Kyle Hendricks, Gregory Polanco, Devers, Real Muto, I hate flipping cards, Hamilton, Robles, Garcia, Nicky Lopez, Yolmer Sanchez, Collins, Carpenter, Kimbrell, Mike Mussina, Decades Best Insert, John Means, Turkey Red, Woodruff, and Nelson Cruz. So a subpar pack, but can't get an auto in every one. So I think Mason will be very happy with that. Uh, is your up? I'll, uh, if you need me to go over the cards, let me know. Uh, we have the Ryan Sandberg PSA 7 with the 2018 update. So that's still lurking out there, which is pretty crazy. Um, you know, the guy, first seven guys will be kicking themselves if, uh, they, if something comes out of that. Um... And that comes with a. Just putting the store in this for Mason. Cliff, what is up, man? What's going on? Um, that comes with a bat relic of Eddie Murray. And that's a Sandberg. After that, that nostalgic, kind of really cool MJ PSA 7. You'll like that one, Cliff. Uh, a Rod and for Call. And then 2019 Bowman. How sick of a card is that, dude? That's like an MJ baseball card. And then lastly, we got that 85 Tops Pete Rose. Manager, first base. Alomar. And 2020 Heritage. So is your up. Just let me know what you want, man. I'm going to rip it for you. Definitely some good options on the on the packs. Like, you know, these two are pretty hard to come by right now. So, um, we'll see. Hopefully, we can get something good out of them. Yeah, it's a nice card, man. I got a I got a stack of Jordans. Uh, I think I submitted a couple to get uh to get graded, but I got all the classic. You know, the classic Jordan baseball cards. Picked them up right before the last dance. So I got a little lucky. I got that. Jordan. I love that card. That's an iconic one. Yeah. They're cool. They're all beat up, but they're pretty cool. So it's is Big Hits, and then Ryan. Let's see what Ryan gets. I'll send it to, uh, to Iz. I know he was on earlier. He might have had to popped off for a second. And again, uh, while I'm waiting for Iz to see if he's going to pop back on, um, I am doing a podcast tomorrow, so definitely check that out. Um, I'll put the link out on Instagram before, um, a little nervous, but more excited. Um, you know, just gonna, you know, I'm talking about baseball cards, so there's really nothing to be nervous about. Um, it's gonna be fun. Probably talk about like, you know, how the hobbies transcended. Um, you know, from being collectors to now being more of an investment, and kind of finding that uh, that line. You know. Where you don't drive yourself crazy, you know, trying to chase after that big card too much. Because that can really, you know, be a financial burden, not, you know, and also, you know, a stressor. Like, this is supposed to be fun, you know, we're collecting baseball cards, you know, you shouldn't be stressing over it. Um, just keep that in mind. I know sometimes you want that card so bad. And it seems like it's right in front of you. And that's the worst part. But, um, you know, it is kind of like gambling. So if you do think you have an addiction, you, you know, don't feel like you can't talk to somebody about it. Um, not that anybody in here is like that, but, um, uh, going to be talking about a wide array of things. I'm really excited. Uh, it doesn't look like Iz is in here. So the choice would be Ben. What's up, man? How's it going, brother? 
Uh, the choice would be... I gotta just check, make sure. It's either gonna be the Sandberg or the Rose, so I just gotta make sure. Yeah, it's Sandberg. It would be the Ryan Sandberg PSA 7 from 86 Tops in the brand new slab. The Eddie Murray, and then I'm excited to rip this. We'll see, uh, we'll see what he gets, man. If, uh, if there's anything big out of here, that would be pretty cool. So good luck, Is. I'll be uh, saving this so you can see. This is definitely the, uh, the best value pick based on what's left. Uh, Freddie Freeman, Escobar. Shinsu Chu, all-star game. Duval. Oh, man, I got excited. Rainbow Foil, Archie Bradley. Chipper Jones, 2018 Hall of Fame. Reggie Jackson, postseason. That's a sweet card, dude. I didn't rich, rip much uh, 18 update. I wasn't uh, really in the hobby back then. Kind of took a little hiatus. Uh, Ricky Henderson, Postseason. Willie Adamas and Carson Kelly. So, dang, none of, the, uh, none of the rookies that you're looking for. I got excited with that rainbow foil, though, not going to lie. Damn. Uh, big hit, you're up. And then it's going to be Ryan. See what he gets. I know. I think I know who Ryan would want here, too. So, um, we'll see. Maybe the car, maybe the pack you want you would pick you would have picked all along right it's gonna be there I mean I can't speak for you but I yeah there you go so big hits is going home with the 1985 tops the beautiful design Pete Rose first base manager also the Alomar and then Heritage uh, and Ryan I don't want to speak for you but you're a Chicago guy and bet that uh bet that Jordan's pretty cool to go home with. See if we can get you anything in here. Uh, Kevin Kiermeyer, Miggy, Victor Reyes, Corbin, Ballinger, it's a nice card. Samarja, Yuli, Gary Sanchez. I love that card because it, it mirrors the, uh, the Thurman Munson card. I wish I had one to show you side by side, but... Look up uh, the Thurman Munson card. You'll see. And then Brandon Workman. Yeah, I, I knew you would want you would have wanted one of them. So that's really cool that that, that worked out, man. I'm glad that uh, that happened. I know you're a big Chicago guy. Uh, I only have two minutes left, so I'm not gonna rush it. But Ryan's gonna be going home with the PSA seven near mint upper deck. A rod in for call. Let's see what we get out of the bone pack. This could be a, a, a huge, a huge last pack. Low Isaga. Anytime, big hits, man. Love having you in here. Thanks for taking up the, that last spot. Really appreciate it. You and David both. Granky, Suarez, Anderson, Davis, Crawford. First Bowman of. Uh, Genesis Cabrera. Oof. This is Purple Paper of Shane Boz. Ooh, that's a good one. Julio Pablo Martinez, first Bowman Chrome. Nice, man. Congrats on that. Big prospect for sure. Congrats, dude. That's nice. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. prospect card. And Jay Groom. So there you have it, guys. Um, I am going to have to hop off just because I have 30 seconds left. I'll hop right back on, say a little recap. But I'm uh, going to end it now. If you want to hop back on, see a little review, uh, do that now.